What is up guys? This is Syphic coming back at you with a uh, all Turbo Graphics PC Engine Turbo Duo pickups video. Uh, I was going to do a, just a general pickups video, but I got so much stuff that's all just turbo related. I just had to do uh, its own video. Uh, I mean, I've got some stuff here that you're going to flip out on because I flipped out on. Um, I uh, was able to accumulate a lot of this stuff within the last like month and a half, and as busy as work was, I was still able to you know get in some deals, uh, some eBay swipes, and uh, lots of uh, local hookups and just you know hookups from friends and stuff like that within the community that uh, were able to offer me some killer stuff that I'm super super awesome and excited to add to the collection. And some of the stuff here also will be available at the SoCal Retro Gaming Expo, as some of this stuff is duplicates, or are duplicates. So, if you guys are making it out to the SoCal Retro Gaming Expo in uh, late January, some of this stuff will be available. So, um, hit me up if you need anything, or if you see anything you need here. Um, so, let's start off with, um, um, actually, a, a free gift. Uh, my friend Brian hooked it up with a title. Uh, I believe this is a PC Engine title called Chris Adventure, and uh, we actually saw some gameplay footage of this, and uh, it looked like a lot of fun. It looked like a pretty cool action platformer. He got an extra copy, so he hooked it up and let me have it. So, Brian, thank you for the hookup uh, on that. Really appreciate that. Uh, on the Facebook groups, actually, um, a gentleman who's actually on the PCFX forums as well had a couple of items uh, available. Um, and a lot of the items I needed, and he, um, kind of had a best offer option on some of this stuff, and, uh, I had to definitely, uh, jump on it, uh, he gave me an insane price on this stuff, um, I would say, like, an ultra insane price, and I was able to pick up a bunch of Turbo Graphics, Turbo Play magazines, uh, among a couple of boxes that he had that I needed, uh, one of the first boxes that I needed, was uh, Jack Nicholas Turbo Golf. I already had the game, but I needed the box, and he had the box, and it's in really nice shape, and uh, glad to knock another one out. Another title, actually, that uh, is kind of going up there, boxed, uh, is Bloody Wolf. Uh, once again, I already had the game, he had the box, and uh, once again, it came in great shape, and i um, super stoked to add that one and knock another one off the list of games that I need uh, to get the box for. And then he had a bunch of Turbo Play magazines, um, and I took the ones basically that I needed. And I'm super excited to have some of these. Some of these are going up in price. I mean, you see them listed for like 20, 30, 40 bucks, and I think I paid less than 10 each. Um, so we got the, uh, this is one that a lot of people look for, and it's the Splatterhouse uh, Turbo Play issue. This is August, September 1990. Super excited to have that. Uh, Turbo Play from October, November 1990. Uh, I believe this is the Bloody Wolf one. And uh, there's that one. Uh, also got April, May of 92. There's that one there. Got Turbo Play February and March. Uh, where uh, there's a couple of guys in the front fighting over a duo. Really nice to have that. Got December, January of 1991. Got the uh, Darkwing Duck, which is uh, December, January of 92. Uh, got the uh, June, July of 92 with uh, Air Zonk on the cover of that one. Got February and March of 91. The Sinistron featured on that one. Got uh, Turbo Play June and July of 91 with uh, Bonks in the front of that one. Then got Turbo Play August, September of 92 on that one. And last but not least, got Turbo Play from April, May of 91. And so all these are issues that I did not have and I'm super excited to add those to the collection. And like I said, to get uh, both those boxes, and uh, all these issues, the deal was, I mean, insane. I, I mean, it's, you know, I was super ecstatic to get that. So thank you. You know who you are. If you happen to be a fan of my channel and watch my videos, thank you once again. 
um, got a really nice uh, eBay lot. Uh, was on eBay, uh, just kind of at the middle of the night looking for stuff. And saw uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight Hue cards um, for 40 shit. First one was World Class Baseball. Vig's Tactical Gladiator. Taking it to the hoop. Uh, Military Madness. TV Sports Football. Keith Courage. R-Type. And Battle Royale. So uh, I thought that was a pretty uh, pretty nice uh, fair deal on those. Um, I already have most of these titles, so I'll be passing these on to uh, you guys. So if anybody needs these, uh, let me know. I'll give you guys a really good price. Um, these will be at the SoCal Retro Gaming Expo as well at our booth. So make sure to check us out at our booth. Another eBay uh, swipe. Uh, that was a pretty nice one, actually. Um, I had a $100 eBay gift card, so I was able to use that towards this um, that I got for Christmas. And when this popped up, it was a USA seller, and I had to jump on it. Now, how could I not? Uh, it looks like uh, it was listed as um, uh, freshly uh, recapped and new laser recalibrated, and it was a Duo R. Now, I already have a Duo R, so this will be available for sale or trade. And uh, it came with its uh, controller. And uh, it came with uh, three titles. Uh, Lords of Thunder. Darius Plus. Super Darius. And it came with its controllers and its accessories and all that. And what was cool about this uh, lot is it was really cheap. Um, so basically I'll be able to keep those uh, two PC Engine titles which I didn't have and the Lords of Thunder is a duplicate and I basically should be able to make my money back and maybe like a little profit and be able to keep those two titles so that was super super awesome uh, super happy to make that deal um, and it was oh, another eBay little swipe uh, I needed a copy of Motor Rotor uh, mine was missing the manual um, and I was able to find the box and the game complete so the box manual, the game, this was 12 bucks. I don't know how it uh, flew under the radar, but no one else bid on it. And I was the only one that jumped on it and it sold during the day, which is kind of weird. So another game to knock off the uh, list of games I needed boxed. And let's see here. Um, this is a pretty cool little free gift I got from a, um, I guess, sort of like a fan or friend at a local meetup. He does a Perler Arts on uh, Instagram. His name is Level11 and he hooked it up with uh, Jackie Chan. Uh, I thought it was pretty cool. He had this one in a splatter house, but uh, I gave the splatter house to my buddy Jose, and I was able to keep the Jackie Chan. Uh, would have loved to have both, but uh, can't be greedy, so I kept this one. I thought this one was kind of cool. So thank you once again for the gift. And uh, I was able to knock off a really nice piece. Um, now, it was my birthday in November, and uh, I decided to treat myself to something very, very nice. This popped up, and I think uh, for the price I paid, I think it was a pretty nice steal. And that is a f official and real version of Sapphire. Uh, probably uh, the second hardest game to get for the PC Engine besides uh, Darius Alpha. And this one is complete. It has the spine card, the disc, the registration card, and I got this for like maybe half of what this might go for. Um, turns out that the guy I was dealing with was a guy who I had been talking to on Facebook a while back and uh, we worked out a deal and I was able to get this and to add that to the collection. Super excited to have that, uh, which is really, really awesome. And uh, let's have a look and see here. Now, locally, a buddy of mine by the name of Alan J. Vintage Games uh, has a store at Frank and Sons. Uh, came across a lot of boxed, uh, just the boxes for a bunch of Turbo Graphics games. Um, I needed a bunch of them that he had, and I was able to work out a deal. I did miss out on a couple of them that I really needed, but I'm not going to complain because what I got here is pretty sick. Uh, now, two of these are I needed. The rest of them are going to be duplicates and will be available for sale or for trade. Uh, the one that I did need was a World Sports Competition. And it's these are like in mint condition. They came with a tray. Um, and I was able to complete it. So, um, yeah, came with the tray. The, you know, and, and everything was inside. So, um, thank you for that. Another game that I needed the box for was Monster Lair. Uh, like, once again, I had the game. just needed the box. And it came with the box in styrofoam. And the rest of these here um, came with the package, and uh, these are going to be uh, available for sale or for trade. And all of them come with their foam, uh, Vigilante. 
uh, Alien Crush, Battle Royale, Champions Forever Boxing, and a really hard to get uh, box actually is Time Cruise. Uh, the game is going up in price, uh, and to find the box with the tray and everything uh, in mint condition, insane. Uh, I mean, so this is also available for sale or for trade as well. And um, the last item I picked up is probably one of the top items I've been looking for. Uh, if you've been following my channel, you know that I've had like 10, 15 duos in my collection at one point or another. Um, and I even had um, one with the box, but the box was pretty beat up. Um, no styrofoam or anything. And a local buddy of ours uh, who owns a store called Super Video Game Bros has been having some great luck with some turbo duos. Uh, he got a really minty boxed one uh, that I missed out on uh, about a month ago. Uh, I had inquired about it, but he ended up hooking it up, uh, hooking up one of his bros with it. I told him if you ever come across another one, hit me up right away. And sure enough, about a month later, he says he got another Cherry Turbo Duo in the box. Now, this is like super mint. Uh, the box is in excellent condition. The system is still in its wrapper. The controller, I mean, it looks like someone just probably like opened it up and just played it for a little bit, put it back, and then never touched it again. Uh, the game, the both games that come in the box are in their little white uh, uh, little box they came in. The E's, the Lords of Thunder, um, uh, has the Ninja the Ninja Spirit game in there. It has all the manuals, the warranty. The only thing missing is the coupon book, which uh, I already have a friend who I think might have one and might be hooking it up, and I'll show that in the next video. And then the only thing missing is that and the OB strip. But uh, check it out. I almost feel bad touching it but look at that this thing is a cherry super mint turbo duo in the box i mean it's in excellent condition uh looks like somebody just had this at this display piece uh, i mean i don't even want to open it up but i mean it's in immaculate condition and will definitely be the centerpiece of my uh the turbo collection uh and i got a really nice price i've been seeing what these have been going for uh not even in this condition they've been going for more than what i paid so he hooked it up amazing price and i'm super super happy cannot complain about that so um I, like i said i haven't had time to go to no swamp meets or nothing like that i've just been just kind of willing and dealing and meeting people and making deals and trades and you know uh i don't really have time right now to be waking up early to go to swamp meets and flea markets and stuff and just all this stuff has been coming through with just trading and connections and you know local deals and stuff like that so yeah, that's all for uh, for this video, guys. I'll be posting another video maybe later today or tomorrow uh, showing the other stuff I picked up. This is just all the Turbo stuff I picked up within the last month and a half, but I have some other insane stuff that I picked up for other consoles as well. So uh, that's about it for the Turbo stuff, guys. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this stuff. And um, if you have any questions or want to trade some of this stuff that's duplicates, let me know. Since now I got this duo, I'll have my personal duo will be available for sale or for trade since I have this cherry one I'm keeping. And then this extra duo R will also be available for sale or for trade, uh, most likely at the uh, SoCal Retro Gaming Expo in the City of Industry at the end of uh, January. If you need details, I'll have post a link below in this video. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and share this video. And then until the next video, this is Cyphic once again signing out. Take care, guys. Lates.